how to install exposed framework on any android device using elseposed hey peeps what's up manchi here back with another video and in this video i'm going to show you how you can install exposed framework on any android device using elseposed as you can see i do have my poco f1 which right now is running a custom rom called havoc os based on android 11 however this process should work on all android devices including android 12 developer preview 3 which is the latest android 12 version at the time of recording this video now what are the prerequisites for this video well you do need to be rooted using magisk and need to have magisk manager installed and you also need to have an active internet connection on your device those of you who want to use ed exposed i do have a separate video for that as well which can be found in the description of this video for starters let us open magisk and check for safety net as you can see safety net right now is failing for me do note i am using the latest canary build of magisk because again at the time of recording this video the latest magisk stable build does give you a safety net api error fix for that is also linked in the description of this video so let us now go into settings and enable magisk hide first and then check for safety net one more time so as you can see safety net is now passing after i enabled magisk hide and i do not have any other modules installed on my device all the files all the applications all the websites which we are going to use in this video are linked in the description of the video so first up we are going to open fx file manager i am using fx file manager because i like it and it lets me install apks you are free to use any file manager which is going to let you install an apk so i'll go into main storage and then i will go into download here i have an application called redo manager apk so we are going to allow fx to install apks and then install the redo manager application once that is done it has appeared on our home screen in case it does not appear for you you will find it in your application drawer open it it is going to ask for super user request granted so as you can see redo is not installed now the first thing we need to do to install exposed framework using else post is to install redo so we're going to open magisk manager tap on the floating bar fourth option it is going to take us to the modules page tap on search and here we are going to search for redo r i r u and here it is the latest version at the time of recording this video is 25.4 we are going to tap on the down arrow and then say install again make sure you do have an active internet connection once the install has finished successfully make sure you reboot your device now we are on the boot animation do note in case you run into a boot loop caused by a magisk module you can find the fix for that in the description of this video as well now back into android we are going to unlock our device open magisk manager and then go to the modules page as you can see redo installed and it is active next thing let us open the redo app one more time bam here it is the app is detecting redo next thing we need to do is install else post so we will go to the official website of else post which is again linked in the description of this video do note this is a github page else post is open source so in case you're worried about people spying on you you can of course check out the open source code over there and supported versions 8.1 to 12 dp3 next thing we need to do is download l exposed so go to the github release page latest release at the time of recording this video 1.3.5 scroll down tap on assets here it is the release zip tap on it it is going to download it once that is done we can go back to the home screen open magisk manager one more time we are still on the modules page fourth option install from storage three dot menu on the top right for those of you who are running android 10 and there you need to select show device or something like that i am running android 11 so i do not need to do the three dot thing i will tap on the three bar menu on the top left select my device's name in this case the poco f1 all files which you download directly on your phone go to the download folder 
So tap on download, here it is, else posed in the building. Select it, it is a Magisk module. Once the module has installed successfully, reboot your device. Back into Android, we will unlock our device once again. Open Magisk Manager, Modules tab. As you can see, Riru else posed is installed and active. Let us open the application drawer. Here it is, we do have else posed application. Let us open this and as you can see else post activated now in some case you might get partially activated in that case all you need to do is make sure you have the latest version of magisk not the latest version of magisk app but the latest version of magisk so if you're getting an update option in your magisk for the magisk itself not the app but for magisk make sure you update it in my case i do not have any issues now another scenario is wherein you might not get this else posed application what do you do then well all you need to do then is go back to the else posed releases page and download the manager apk manually so as you can see assets right now are three you need to look for a release which has four assets so let's see so here this one 1.1.0 assets are four tap on it here it is you have the apk explicitly available for download download this apk and install it now you have to do this if and only if you do not get the else posed application after installing the magisk module what do you do next well go to the repository download whatever module you want to and give it a try next thing before i forget let us check for safety net so here it is check for safety net one more time and bam safety net is still passing so this might be one of the advantages of else posed over ed exposed that safety net is not affected but do note a lot depends on your custom rom your device and any other modules which you might have installed in my case i do have this else posed along with the module installed on my redmi k20 pro as well so here it is else posed is installed activated module i'm using is the ambient music mod do note right now the module is highlighted which means it is enabled if i tap on it you will see i have enabled this module so once you install any module you might have to enable it explicitly and reboot your device for the changes to kick in you also have the option of selecting what all options you want the module to be enabled for and that is something which the developer of the module might be able to answer but any case ambient music mod is working absolutely fine on my redmi k20 pro we do have a separate video for that as well this is your pixel lock screen music mod but why we are here is to check for safety net on this device as well which has else post installed and active sorry about that i'm not sure why the application crashed let us check for safety net one more time and there it is safety net is passing without any issues do note i have magisk hide enabled on this device as well and if i go into the modules page you will see i again have ambient music mod redo and redo l exposed so there it is peeps that is how you install exposed framework on your android device and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you